love to hear it. The last few weeks have been the best of her life. Fantastic. And we see Nina Kenny. She just missed her first attempt at that brand new personal best of 485. But we get to the final track event here for the night. We just had the women's 100 meter final and it's now time for the men's 100 meter final. Nine athletes in the final. Couldn't split. So all the athletes are here. Jake Doran lines up in lane two. In lane three, Joshua as a party. In four, Dr. Simon Gregg. In five, Rowan Browning. Lane six, Jake Penny. In lane seven, Edward Osai Nikita. In lane eight, Alexander Harmon. Lane nine, Will Roberts. And in lane 10, Jack Hale. The meet record, 10.08, set by Josh Ross. All those years back, 2007. Could we see another equal or broken meet record here? Well, that, the ladies' record was 2007 too, wasn't it? Look, at, look, it's lining up. The it planets is. are lined up. I'd love to see a 10.08. We know that Rowan's Ro run a 10.08. He's also run a 10.05. Could be something special. So the light shows on, fire is spurting out of the stands and all eyes are focused in on this 100 metre final. Really looking forward to this one. Anabasi's just proven this is a fast track. The big supporters from Josh has a party. And so all of Camden have come out. And he's wearing the Camden strip. That's what I love to see. Yep. The club kit. There's Dr. Simon Gregg. Next to be introduced is he sits alone of the third spot, the fastest Australian of all time. He owns the fastest time on home soil. And he's Rowan Browning. Jake Penny next up. He's been so consistent. And we have the second fastest New Zealand athlete of all time, the fastest being his dad. It's a nice little family tree at the top there. 10-11, his dad ran. 10-12, his son ran at the Queensland Track Classic. There's Alex Hartman. Tomorrow, he'll go for a record six 200-metre titles in a row. He currently sits equal with Peter Norman. Next up, Will Roberts. A fantastic heat run. What can he produce in the final? And then... Out in lane 10. I don't think the last time Hale was been in lane 10 would have been a long time ago. Would have been a heat. Would have been a heat. See what he can do out there. The men's 100 metre final. The Australian Track and Field Championships Tokyo qualifier. Good start, so is Eddie Nikita, but Browning's in front. Simon Gregg's running well, but Browning's pulling away from the field. Eddie Nikita gets up to second, but Rowan Browning, 10, 10. Oh, it's fantastic. <laughs> Let's get another drop. 10, 10. Oh, 10.09. 10.09, <laughs> give it to him. <laughs> Check the photo. Oh, let's have a look. We actually have it right next to us. Let's... So Jake Penny gets up third across the line, but second Australian. And I think Will Roberts might have gotten up for bronze there. He did, yeah. There it is. 10.43. So Will Roberts gets up for the bronze medal. 
but 10.09. Now, Rowan Browning has an 08, an 05, and an 09. Unbelievable, and <laughs> heads straight to the trackside bar. Here's the replay. He's just got, again, same as Bassick, no weak part of his race. No, not at the moment. The way he's able to finish and push through the line, it just... <laughs> He's actually just gone down trackside and chucked a beer. <laughs> well, it is what it is. Uh, and even, again, Rowan says he can't run in a straight line. He was nearly out of his lane again. Uh, That's the 01. He's been looking forward to this. He's been wanting this so much. He, he was so disappointed back in 2019 to not take that title. And here he is in 2021. He's taken his first national 100 meter title. Look at the times, they're so close. 43 for Will Roberts, 43 for Jack Hale, 48 for Hartman, 49 for Greg, and 50 for Azza Party. Oh. Wow. I reckon Doran wouldn't have been too far off that 50 either. What a race. But we go down to Tamsin with your men.